Good morning. It's Tuesday, November, oh, November 28th already, 2023. It's 632 in the morning, coming to you from the east coast of the United States in the deep down south of the state of Georgia. Can you hear my southern accent? <laughs> sort of southern mixed with New York. Um, so, yeah, it's really fall here now. Um, in the summer, it's usually dry a lot. And then when the fall starts coming on, the weather gets colder and we get rain. It rarely gets cold enough, though, to have snow. On the days where it's like, you know, 32 or below, it's dry, usually. I wanted to jump back on here, by the way. I don't have a whole lot to say today, but I want to let you know I'm still alive and kicking. So I've got some Levanto coffee here, or espresso. It's by Nespresso. And um, Levanto is an area near Genoa, Italy, where um, it used to be an important port and a lot of coffee beans would come in from South America. Like this is back, you know, a few hundred years ago. Anyhow, so this espresso is named after the city uh, Levanto. And I'm gonna put some coffee made in my cup. My cup, isn't that cute? I got this in the Cotswolds in Great Britain. Mm, how many years ago? Three years ago, I think, or four years ago, um, my daughter and son-in-law and I spent a week driving around the Cotswolds. Oh my gosh, it was wonderful. Well, anyway, <clears throat> so I got that cup there. Let's see, espresso. And um, it turns out that there's a company in the United States that sells cups by that same company that made the cup in Great Britain. So um, I was really happy to be able to get some more uh, cups from them too that are really pretty. Okay, so I've got this great big old cup here. And here, let me let you look in. A <laughs> big cup, not a lot in it. Ah, that's okay. <laughs> I didn't plan well this morning, obviously. So who went to Black Friday sales? I don't go out of the house on Black Friday. Um, I will say, though, that I did have to go to Kohl's, K-O-H-L, apostrophe S, which is a store in, I think, the southeast. I don't know if they're up north or out west. And they were having some amazing sales. So I got this. This is one of those Yankee candles. You know, it comes with, a, you know, one of these lids. It's like a $30 candle, and I got it for $12. Yay, Black Friday. So, but I didn't go on Friday. I went, I don't know, either before Friday or after Friday. Anyhow, <laughs> so I felt like this year is the first year, in my opinion, that Black Friday was really worth it, that there were really significant sales and where they didn't run out of stuff. So... You know, I'm sure when you go to a store for something and uh, like that's on a Black Friday sale and you're in there, you're more likely to say, oh, you know, I need one of those or I could use that or, oh, look, this would be a give, good gift for so-and-so. You know, so you probably, probably spend more money that way, I would think. You know, it attracts people in. Well, anyhow, so let me try my Levanto Espresso with uh, Coffee Mate. It's just really good. You know, every once in a while these days, I want to have a sweet drink, like the kind, you know, what they call, I guess, a blended drink, a coffee one, no alcohol, <laughs> that you would, you know, go out to Starbucks or someplace like that to get. But most of the time, I really just enjoy the the natural flavor of the coffee with a little bit of half and half or coffee mate or almond milk. 
regular milk. Mmm, it's, it's just really delicious. I, and it's complex, too. It's not just like one single flavor. Well, anyhow, okay, for somebody who didn't have a whole lot to say, I think I've said enough. And uh, I hope that you have a wonderful day today. I hope that you're able to spend some time relaxing, even if you're doing stuff. Oh, you know what? I'm listening to this book right now. And I think it's called A Far Cry from Kensington. And in the beginning of the book, the lady says, um, she talks about insomnia. And she says, you know, there's a, a positive kind and a negative kind. The negative kind is where you lay there and think about problems. She said, what you can do is, you you know, you've had enough problems during the day. So when you lay down at night, think about things you would like to think about. Put yourself into situations in your mind where, you know, it would be interesting to be or you'd enjoy being. And she said, oh, you know, from the same point of view, you could sit in front of a TV, but leave the screen dark. Don't turn it on. And put your own show on there. Imagine your, if you want to, put yourself in the situations. Or imagine what you would like to see. Oh, I thought that was a delightful idea. And very practical. So, have a good day. And there's some advice for you if you have insomnia. Okay, I'll talk to you later.